Hey guys, so it's that time of the month again where my Violet Box subscription has turned up. So I thought I would quickly make this video before I do a trip back to Kingaroy for a few days because then I won't be up to, able to upload. So I'm going to do my Violet Box for October 2014 um, video and yeah, so let's get into it. So this is what it came like, just the normal violet box that you've seen before and then you open it up and it's got the normal tissue paper and you open it up even more and then you've got a little thing inside. So this is what the card looks like for this month, oh, here's my fish tank. Um, this is what the card looks like for this month, so it's got As Seen in Vogue, so we got some of these. Evelyn products last month, so yeah, I'm guessing we can go and I might check that out. So I've got all the details of the stuff on the back, and this month is all about lips, I do believe, um, and face and, and stuff like that. But um, there looks to be like a mixture of things. So let's have a look at the first thing which I'm picking up, which is a PHR. Recovery Leave In Moisturizer. So the cards, so this is what it comes like. And the card says, recommend, um, it says PHR Professional Hair Care Recovery Leave In Moisturizer. Recommended retail is $39.95 for 125ml, so obviously this is a sample. Um, a blend of all natural ingredients, including jojoba seed oil and keratin. This rich leave-in moisturizer is designed to seal in hydration leaving your hair renewed and full of luster. Well, I might actually give this a go. I've never heard of this company before and I do love trying new hair stuff and it's got keratin in it which keratin is so good for your hair because that is what makes up your hair shaft. So yeah, I will give this a go and let you know how it goes and I will also check out their details. So the next thing that's in here is what not facial wipes. That's what it looks like. And you've got five wipes in there. And it says what not facial wipes for oily slash sensitive skin. Which is good because that's exactly what I have. So recommended retail for five pack, which is what I've got, is $1.95. So it says made with certified organic pink grapefruit, papaya and rose hip roses. This is makeup. This is a makeup bag essential. Removes daily impurities and grime and the toughest of makeup. So that's what it looks like. I love getting white, uh, makeup wipes and facial wipes in these packs because I love trying new ones. So I can't wait to try that out. The next thing in this box is Essilor in introductory collection. So that is what it looks like. And it open it up. Oh, and there's little samples inside. So, this is the Essilor Introductory Collection Envelopes. So you've got the refining cleanser, the peeling gel, the mask, and the day cream. And I will, because they're all, there's a few, I will link, I'll put all the details below of the prices and such. And they've all got different things, so I will link all that down below because there's a few there. And yeah, it just says here that it's supposed to be good for hydrating, protecting, and treating. So I will definitely try those out. So the next few things are, I'll do this one, this is this one here, so it's by Designer Brands and it's in the colour 412 Fuchsia Rose, that's what it looks like, it's not quite a bad colour. So this one, Designer Brands Lip Pencil. So recommended retail is $4.99 and that's for a full size, which is that one. So it's designer brands lips pencils, a luxury, luxurious, soft offering, incredible definition without bleeding. So that's definitely good. So yeah, it looks really like, why do I keep putting the card in my face? This looks like it would be a really good lip pencil and it's a really nice color too. So yeah, I will definitely give this a go and let you know what I, how it is because I don't really haven't really tried many lip pencils, so I will give that a go. And I'm sorry, I'm going through this really quickly. It's just it's really hot in this room. So 
So the second last thing is, it's called Haughty Perfect Finish Lip Gloss. So that's what the packaging looks like. And I got it in Pull It Together is what the thing is. Let me see if I can get it in. Oh, that's quite pretty. So that's the packaging. Apart from that box. So that's the packaging. It's got like a little diamante looking thing on the top. That's really cool. Let's have a look. Oh yeah. It's like a really dark red colour. So which isn't too bad. So this one is called Haughty Cos Cosmetics. Perfect finish gloss. So recommended retail is $23.95 and that is for full size which is what this one is. Um, this lip gloss smells awesome. Smells awesome. It does smell off awesome, but it feels awesome and stays on. It's the fastest way to pol feel polished, confident, pretty, and put together all day, L all day long. Perfect finish lip gloss is paraben-free, never tested on animals, and made with love in the USA. So this is a, a little bit upset because it's not an Australian item, but that's okay. Um, I love trying stuff from overseas. I really like the packaging. It's really cute. And as I've said in the muddle up a second ago, it smells really good. So, yeah, I'll definitely give this a go and um, let you know what I think. But I think it's really pretty. So, there's one more thing in the box. If I can get it out. And it is this lip stick. And it is from Colour Eternal. And I got Pink Rouge. And I'll read it first. Uh, where are you? Number four. Designer Brands. So this is by Designer Brands again. Um, Eternal Color Lipstick. Recommended retail is $9.95, which this one is. Um, rich, full coverage lipstick. Vitamin E based formula that locks in color that lasts. And non-drying, non-caking or flaking formula. Now that is good. Now let's have a look at the color. Oh wow. It's a really nice nudie pink colour. Oh, isn't that pretty? You can't really see, can you? It's a really nice pink, like rose pink colour. It will probably go with that thing that I got before. Um, I actually have wanted a lipstick of this colour, so I am very, very happy with this. So I can't wait to try this. So, yeah, that's everything. Um, so... That is everything that I got in my, yes, I'm going to drop it on the floor, um, last, uh, last, violet box. Oh my god, get it to get, oh, um, my violet box for October 2014. I'm actually really, really happy with this, um, month's box. I am just getting into, like, lipsticks and things, so I'm really, really liking this box, and I will definitely, definitely, um, check, check the, all these products out. Um, if you got Violet Box this month, let me know in the comments below um, what you thought, whether you liked yours or didn't. If you got different colours in those um, lipsticks and things, because I do believe there are different colours as well. So let me know in the comments below um, and tell me what you think. Um, also, um, if you've got any video ideas or, you know, anything else you want me to have a look at, you can also leave it in the comments below. Um, if you really like this type of video, please give it a thumbs up. If you don't, well, let's just not talk about it. Um, so yeah, if you got Violet Box, please let me know what you thought for October 2014. I'd love to know what you thought because, yeah, I have a different opinion to you. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty much it because... There's nothing really else. And this video is going to be really quick, and I'm really sorry. Um, but I am going to be filming some more stuff over the next few days. I just can't post it, which sucks. But what can you do when you go out to the bush? So, um, yeah, please give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And let's not talk about the bad stuff, all right? Um, and I will see you in the next video.